I use the cut tool in Audacity. So today I'm going to be showing you how to use the cut tool basically that allows you to trim songs or audio files that you have. Um, so first what I'm going to do is first import a file. I'm going to click on file in the upper left hand corner here and then I'm going to select on open. Okay, and then I've got my music folder here already and then I'm going to be using Levianth Axel um, I'll post the link in the description for this song. Um, it's a non-copyright song, so hopefully that won't that won't, won't affect my video from being copyrighted. So basically, um, what we're going to want to do is find a section of this song that we like, that we want to use. Um, a lot of times people will use this for making compilations in which they have like bass drops or stuff like that. So we'll, we'll try to find a good section where the bass drops and we'll see if we can cut that out of the song so we can export it and then use it as a different file for something else. So first what we can do here is go ahead and just hit play and then we can go ahead and listen to the song. So it's good to try and figure out where exactly in the song you want to start. But what's good about Audacity is that you can just scroll along the top here and find where uh, just by looking at it where the waves get bigger so you have a good idea of where it starts. So I'm thinking probably right around here. Yep, so we're going to go to, let's say, let's go like right, right right around this area, right here, right where I clicked, okay? So what I'm going to do is after I've clicked there, okay, I'm just going to click and drag. So I'll do that again, okay? So click right here for this section because I want to start right about here, right? Click and drag this, all right? And then what I'll want to do is go up here and hit the cut option and basically it'll just remove this highlighted section that I've just created so I can go ahead and hit cut or I can hit control X and we'll notice that section is now gone so now when we hit play it just starts right there okay so now we want to get rid of this extra section at the end right because we don't want the entire rest of the song so what we'll do is we'll go ahead again and click to where we want to end so I'm thinking probably right about there is good so we'll just go ahead, select the rest of it, control X, cut it out, and then we're left with just this por portion here. So if we go ahead and restart the track, so then it's just this little bit right here. So then this would be a good little clip that I could use in like a bass drop compilation or something like that. Okay. So now I want to go ahead and save this file uh, someplace else where I can use it. So I'll go ahead up to the file section, click on file, and then I'll go ahead and click on export. And then depending on which file format you prefer, I usually go with MP3. I feel that's the most universal option there is. So I'll just go ahead and click on export as MP3. And then we can go ahead and give it a file name. So I'll just do example for this video. Cap. Save as MP3 files, and you can click and search which folder you want to save it into. I'll leave it in my Audacity folder so I know where all my cuts and final edits of songs go to. And then you get some more options here, which are bitrate mode, present variable average, constant. I prefer to leave it the way it is. Um, quality, I always like to go with the best quality sound you can possibly get, and variable speed, usually that is fast. Channel mode, joint stereo, stereo, four subs to mono. Always do joint stereo. That's going to be a better option for you. And then you can go ahead and hit save. Okay. And then if you want, it will also give you this option here to edit some media tags. So you can put in the artist name, track title, yada, 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 as you wish. Um, I don't really feel the need to do this because it was just a small little clip out of an original song that I took. So I'm just going to hit OK. And there we have it. That's how you clip and edit a song within Audacity using the cut tool.